It is really cold here at the SS Klondike. Wow! I am so excited. I am so happy. Welcome back to another travel flight vlog. Alright, we're almost ready to go. We got a bunch of stuff inside here. We got 100 pounds um, per person, so that's that's a bit generous. Well, I guess because of the winter clothes. I have my laptop here. Um, so once we land, I'm gonna pull out all my sweat, my sweatshirt, my sweater, um, triple my layer right away. I have my took, my gloves inside as well. So in my scarf. Whoops. Perfect. All right, time to go to the airport. Be good there, buddy. Got four luggages in total. I think what Air North um, has incorporated... It's mostly boots. Yeah, no. They are generous enough to give us um, 100 pounds of baggage. I'm not sure how it is in Manila. I think in Manila it's so restricted because the tickets are so cheap. But yeah, just because we're going to like a colder place, it means that we are bringing a, a bunch of coats, a bunch of like warm jackets. And that takes up a lot of space and a lot of weight. So kudos to Air North. Tell me how you're feeling. So excited. So excited. How about you, Dad? Sweetie. The birthday boy. The reason why we're going to White Horse <laughs> is because of this guy. <laughs> That's his me. birthday. <laughs> and also his birthday, to be fair, on Valentine's Day. Sun's really annoying, but we've arrived at Park and Fly. I'm just gonna leave the car here. So it's a huge lineup, obviously, because it's a long weekend. We're gonna take the bus going to the airport, which is about 500 meters down there. Are we catching this one or? Hey guys, we have arrived at uh, the domestic side. Um, this is where I usually hang out when I still work for a couple companies here in the airport. Uh, so I kind of know this deep inside my veins. I have to say that. Wow. But yeah, we're off to check in Air North and I'll catch you guys at the check in counters. Hello everyone, are you guys excited or what? Yeah, excited. Ocean. So this is the holy smokes. It's packed. This is the arrivals area. We're going up there. Departures. Up straight back. There you go. That's how it looks like. Alright. That's WestJet. That's Air Canada. Air North is over to that far end, to the left. Always fly Air North. This is your first time with the Air North, but uh, we are now here. So departures. We're gonna check in with you guys later. How's it going, Dad? Happy birthday, Dad. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for the flight. <laughs> so we have arrived. Oh, it looks like here. Pretty neat. Hi, Dad. Hi. Hi. Here we go, online check-in, baggage drop-off. Skip the line here. <laughs> Being helped by a Filipina. It's good. Same last name too, apparently. We finally have checked in. It's always good to have Filipinos help us out. You know, it's easier, I guess, to communicate. We're heading to the gate now? Yeah, we're, we're, we're going in. We're going in for sure. A few inches later. 
Alright guys, just passed through security. I think I got through a secondary inspection there because of my mic here. It's flimsy, it's a dead cat, so... Now I made it through. That's about good. 30 minutes in security there. What's up? Um, There's also a lounge here. Oh, it's called Plaza Premium Lounge too. Such a hassle, it's like rush hour out there in Vancouver. But it's all good now, on the way to the gate. Out here at the furthest part of the uh, domestic airport. So just checking out all the WestJet flights here. But uh, we're gonna grab some uh, dinner and we're gonna wait for our flight. Uh, it's about what? An hour and a half before boarding. Yeah, WestJet. This is all WestJet here. Just wandering around. Gate B18 is right there. But uh, B19 to 26. Looks like it's, uh, it's an older part of the, the airport, like transition from here, there. But yeah, we're waiting for our food still, so might as well take the time to take some time lapses, B roll, stuff like that. Okay, there's an airplane taking off. There's a West Chip. Kind of looks like Naia, to be honest. Naia 1. Okay, I'm quite lost. I've never been in this part of the airport. Gates are very small. That's gate B19. Let's check it out. Nobody's here. It does look like Naia 1, huh? There's much to see here, so let me go back to to the kind of general area there. That's where our food is. It's been taking a while, but it should be okay. One thing I noticed, it's really quiet. felt like there's so many people traveling earlier, but now it's like they're all gone. Uh, yeah, we should have went there. Man, it's always a learning curve. So next time, next time we're here. If we ever, oh, if we go, dito tayo. If we take WestJet, dito tayo. So. We're walking to the gate now. What? 7:05 p.m. Quite stoked to be honest, but I'm quite full as well. As you can see, there's a bunch of gates here, but they're not being used at this time of the day, at this time of the night. So that's our gate. Oh, that's our plane as well. Look, pan, pan out, pan out, pan out. 180. We got the winglets today. Hi. Sure. At Vancouver International, looks like it's overcast at 3,100 feet. But white horse, so far, 15 statute miles of visibility, sky clear, minus 22 degrees. Uh, looks like high pressure is ticking around over white horse there, towering cumulus, so there's like a bit of precipitation up north there. There is YBR. There you go, white horse. So high pressure, quasi stationary, it's sticking around, it's quite clear. Yeah, should be good. Okay, looks like we've got the smaller plane today. It's a uh, ANF, Foxtrot, Alpha November Foxtrot, Boeing 737-500. So I just went on Instagram Live, really enjoyed it. I might do it again, maybe tomorrow, we'll see if uh, internet permits, LTE permits in white course. Now we are... Excited or you sleepy? Sleepy. Mom, let's film up. I haven't said this in the video, but this is the first time I think we're traveling again. All four of us, well, plus Isla, you already get the point. All traveling again, all at the same time. Last time I traveled was with the ocean. I had a pleasant seat in front of you. Flight articles may be stored in the overhead compartment. 
Should you require assistance, please do not hesitate to ask. For your safety and in accordance with government regulations, Air North is pleased to offer you a smoke-free place. Bruh. I can't believe it happened again. But to be fair though, this is the only seat that's left. So it's either this or we don't make the flight. That's the deal. <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna push back in like two minutes here.
to Whitehorse, ladies and gentlemen. The time is 10.35 p.m. For your company and safety, please remain seated with your seatbelt fastened and your carry-on baggage stored until the captain has turned off the seatbelt sign. Prior to deplaning, please ensure you have all your personal belongings with you. Please exercise caution when opening the overhead compartments as some items may have shifted during the flight. On behalf of your entire crew, we'd like to thank you for flying your North Yukon's airline and we hope to see you on board again in the near future. Once again, welcome to White Horse and good night. Just landed. We already feel the cold, but we're gonna pick up our bags and get our rent a car. I'm not sure what car we're getting, but it's supposed to be for pickup at 11 p.m. tonight. So. Thank you, Blaine. Oh, look at that. I walked out of that area. This is apparently the departures, I guess. Um, budget. Still waiting for our bags, but I just needed to get some fresh air. That's cold. That's cold. Wow, that's cold. Holy crap, that's cold. <coughs> All right, now we gotta find the car. Holy, this is minus 30. <coughs> Yo, okay. All right, we're gonna walk. We're gonna walk. We're gonna figure this out. We're gonna take. <coughs> we're gonna. We're <coughs> gonna. gonna take some photo. We're gonna grab the car. Apparently, naka, naka plug siya sa heater. Holy crap, ang lamig, man! <coughs> How are you yeah. feeling, mom? You like that cold? Oh, no. You like that cold? <laughs> Damn! Cold. Okay, so we survived. That was about a 5 kilometer drive from the airport to our hotel, which is Days in. Wi-Fi, AC rooms, heater, all that good stuff. But it's really cold, man. I can't, like, stress that enough. Now, this is the best thing about living in the north, I guess. You get to plug your car into an outlet because uh, overnight it gets really, really cold, like minus 30, minus 40. And the car doesn't want to start on that condition, so we need to plug this in before I pop it after I start the car. Perfect. Okay. Here you go. Somewhere. Okay. So I already spent about 60 minutes worth of footage. Now I'm gonna import it to my laptop. Good thing I bought it. I brought it with me. But this is our room. Yeah, it's decent. It's decent. It's the last room as well. Just like the last seat. Because <laughs> we booked everything two, two weeks before. That's not good. Don't do that. Do that. <laughs> That's it. Thank you guys for watching another travel vlog. Tomorrow we're gonna open up with this view here. It's gonna be amazing. Holy, look at that. Hit the like button, subscribe. And hit the bell icon for me as well. And as always, guys, thank you so much. I'll see you guys on the next one. Later. I ain't got nobody on my mind sometimes. I wish I had you, but I don't. That's fine. So I guess it's okay. Yeah, I guess it's okay. Yeah, I woke up this morning super happy. Gotta get my caffeine and catch up with my homies. Cause we are going up so fast. Don't waste time doing things that never will last. I've been running faster than ever towards all of my dreams. Leaving work at 5 o'clock, then making these beats. What I'm gonna do right now is something that I've really wanted to do for a long time. I'm gonna set up the camera. I'm just gonna do it. Maybe right 